We recently took our first trip to Alaska on our very first Disney cruise. And boy, was it a trip. Come along with us as we tell you the things we liked, the things we didn't like, and the things we absolutely loved about this trip. So let's kick it off with day one on the Disney Wonder, today on Explore Toria. So if you're coming to Vancouver and you're gonna drive in, I highly suggest parking at the uh, the long-term parking at YVR at the airport, at Vancouver airport, and then just taking the Canada line down. It was ridiculously easy. Um, the, the Canada line, like the station is literally right there at the long-term parking. You hop on, um, it's about 25 minute or so ride. You hop off two blocks down, walk two blocks down, and you're here. You're here at the, at the Canada place. Yeah. So, uh, and and parking over there for the long term parking it was about two or three hundred dollars cheaper than if you were to park here at Canada place. We had to do it because um, we booked this cruise kind of last minute. We, we booked it last week, and uh, so all the all of the parking we were originally planning on parking here at, at Canada place, but all of the parking was was booked. It was full. So I had to figure out something else. And I seen a lot of people talking about parking at the airport. So we decided to give it a try. We, we drove up early just in case. And uh, yeah, it was it was super easy and super convenient. And I really, really, really like it, liked it. Like I, I'd definitely do it again. So just keep that in mind if you want to save some money. And we've arrived. Uh, we're getting ready to hop on. Good. Disney Wonder. Who's that? Well, made it through security. We're getting on right now. You ready? Yeah, me too. I bet they're going to say our name when we get on there. You gotta listen. Oh, so we made it now boarding the Disney Wonder. Oh my gosh. Check in process was wild. So uh, how, what time is it? One hour and 15 minutes check-in. So that was, that was fun. But here we are, we're about to get on. Here we go. Yeah. Who's that? Who's that? Pluto. Hot dog. Where did it, Joe? Where did it run the boat? Okay. Whoa. They made it to Cabanas. How's the food, Joe? Hey, how's the food? Good. I got some uh, crab. I hear, I hear the crab and the shrimp is only the first day, so I had to get me some. And then we got the lamb chop. I hear that's the only first day, too. And then salmon, crunchy chicken, french fries, mac and cheese, and some veggies. Uh, she got pretty much the same thing. added broccoli. She got some pasta over there. Some kind of green stuff. What's the green stuff? Like a pea spread or pea protein spread? Yeah. It looks good. We love broccoli, huh? Yeah. So we're gonna dig in here. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta hurry up and, and eat because we got the assembly thing we have to go through. We got here just in time. The whole assembly mustard you know, station thing is so confusing. There's no. There's no signage or anything. There's nothing on the app really that told us what to do. Um, we went to the assembly station and like like, like any other crews, like right after we um, got on board, and there was nobody there. There was nobody to check us in, so it was kind of weird. We didn't know what to do. But we have since figured out that I think everybody's supposed to go on their assembly stations at exactly the same time at 3.30, so. We're, that's why we're finishing up being here quick and then we're gonna go down there and uh, get the assembly over with and then it's time for uh, sail away oh. yeah I just I just wish they would have it would have been more clearly stated how the whole assembly thing was supposed to go. Yeah. 
verdict on the food first day um, at Cabanas. The baked the baked cod, like the crunchy baked cod, the best thing. Uh, the lamb was pretty good, kind of dry. The seafood. Disappointment, man. Disappointment. It was not not that great at all. The crab was stringy and not that good. And uh, the, sh the shrimp was just kind of watery. What do you think of the food? What was your favorite, what was your favorite food? But yeah. Which one was it? The jello. The jello. That was good. That was good. Oh, the chocolate thing you got? That chocolate thing was good. The chocolate mousse? That was good. What did you what did you like? The coffee is the best. But she says the, she said the coffee is the best thing. Me? I'm sticking with ginger ale this uh, I'm gonna be a ginger ale guy, like like I'm on a plane. What did I said about the fish being the best thing? The strawberry pot de creme. I think that's what it's called. Best thing. Best thing. Delicious. Whoa! Captain America. Iron Man. There's so many different things to do. What are you going to do next? That's, uh, what's his name? Yoo-hoo! That dude. I forgot his name. Whoa! Let me see one more time. Let me see. Whoa! Hula hoops for hulaing? No. They're for playing li lily pad. Everybody's playing really bad today. In a kid's cup. Pretty cool guy. It's hard, huh? Is it hard? Mommy, is it hard? Yeah. Hard? I got it out. The main lobby. Lines, lines, lines. This is the Lions cruise. We just got out of line seeing Mickey. We took a picture with Mickey. And then we're in line now to see Daisy. And this one is having the time of her life. Zone out. Dead tired. Bye, Daisy. See, see you in a little bit. See you in a little bit, Daisy. What a day so far. Uh, I, one thing I'll say about the ship, well, a few things I'll say about the ship, Disney Wonder. Um, there's a lot of lines, man. There's just as many lines, I feel, like going to one of the parks. There's there's a lot of lines. But, you know, luckily they're not, they're, they're not as long once you get on the ship. Um, the lines to see the characters. I think today we've we've stood in like five lines so far today, the longest of which was definitely getting on the ship. That was, like I said, took an hour and fifteen minutes just to board and go through customs and everything. Um, you know, and then we we stood in line for Mickey. That was probably the longest character. Of course, everybody wants to see Mickey. Um, we stood in line for Donald, but sadly, um, he left and we got Daisy instead. So, but she. Um, she kind of enjoyed that. My my daughter was kind of bummed because she really likes Donald. Donald's, Donald's her dude. After Mickey, of course. But another thing I'll say about this ship, I noticed, it's it, 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 it's kind of funky in here, man. Not not in the room, per se. Our room doesn't stink. But there's some sections of the ship that they smell pretty bad. It's like they tried to cover whatever odor it was with, like, incense or whatever like lavender or something like that like once every once in a while it's like for like large portions it smells really good it smells like lavender and then all of a sudden it's just a, a section of the ship that you walk through and it just smells like straight up like s sweaty <laughs> sweaty armpits like it's it's pretty bad and then you walk past that section and it's right back oh, to lavender so i don't know man but that's maybe they gotta clean the carpets or something you think they would have cleaned it on their way up here from um like when they moved the ship up to Alaska, you know, but you know, it's just, it's just, a, it's just something we noticed and maybe a complaint that I have uh, so is, you know, clean the carpets. It stinks. But uh, other than that, the food's been great. The staff's been 
pretty friendly, you know. So it's, I thought I, I really thought coming onto the ship it would be a lot more like the parks, you know, the, the crew, the crew um, would be a lot more like the cast members at the parks and who are just like super friendly. Like I, lo- I love the, I love the cast members, Disney cast members at, at uh, Disney parks. I love them. They're so, they're so friendly and helpful and nice. <clears throat> Here's, eh, it's like they want to be that, but at the same time, they're just, they're tired of seeing you every day. <laughs> oh, guess again. Oh God. You know, they're a little bit more run down maybe, but, um, we still haven't even explored the whole ship. It's not that big of a ship, but we just been, there's just so much to do. So next up, our tradition, as we do every cruise, is ice cream every day. So she I was reminded. So today we're going to go get some ice cream. And then the sail away party, interesting, the sail and wave party, is not until 745, which I thought was interesting, between the two dinner uh, seatings. So that's going to be interesting. Um, we had, we do have, uh, tonight we're going to be at Triton's. We had the late seating, so it's 8.15. We'll be at Triton's, and the menu looked really great. There's, there's like lobster on there, so I want to show you guys what that's all about, but it looks like it's going to be good. Um, we're going to get ice cream. ice cream right now is where we're headed. Um, yeah, but, but I don't get popcorn. You're going to get, oh yeah, that's right. You're getting popcorn instead, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll get ice cream after dinner. Uh, Mickey ice cream bar? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you have mommy. We have. You have mommy. We have ice cream. No, I. I have popcorn. You have popcorn. Uh, uh, and tomorrow we have uh, uh, ice cream. Oh, okay. Tomorrow you're gonna have ice cream. But we're gonna get a Mickey ice cream after dinner tonight, right? Yeah. Remember you want an ice cream bar? Okay. How was how was this dance party, the sail away party with Mickey? Yeah. It was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. What was your favorite part? Um, um, what did you get to? What do you order to eat? Um, I I want uh, um, I want cheeseburger and soup. Cheeseburger and soup. All right. Cool. I want dessert, uh, uh, apple pie. An apple pie for dessert. Awesome. I got escargot, and I got duck confit, and I got, what else did I get? Filet mignon. Yeah. Yeah. And a leaking potato soup. Mm. We'll see how it is. What did you get, wife? Um, I got the pear salad. Pear salad. Um, the wild mushroom vegetarian dish uh-huh. with eggplant and the dark confit. How come you didn't get the snails? No snails for you? you, you but you yeah. eat snails before? I know. I was thinking about it. It just kind of grossed me out when I was thinking about it. <laughs> I've never eaten snails before because they grossed me out. So I, it's a cruise. He's trying to do things on cruises because it's free. So I'm trying to free snails. The double crown. Titan's drink. Sugar. It's sugar, okay. How is it? Review? Mm. Review of the review of the situation? It's delicious. It's delicious. What does it taste like? It tastes a little bit like orange juice and maybe like Sprite. Sprite. Really? For crown and uh, it had crown. Wait, in is there alcohol in it? Shambord. Shambord. Yeah. Shambord. Yeah. Shambord. It doesn't taste alcoholic at all. Well, yeah. Oh, the little. Wait, had, yeah, that's all it has is shambord. I had something else. I can't remember. Crown oil. Mm-hmm. That would be two crowns. I, I would so. see. I would say. But this is. It's very light for a dark liquor drink. It's a dark liquor drink, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very yeah, light. Okay. For, as for me, I got the water. Uh, double ice is very crisp. Delicious. Uh, let's try this crowny thingy. 
Double crown. Yeah. Not my jam. Not my jam. Really? It's too tart for me. I'm not a. I don't like. I don't like Crown Royale in the first place, though. I'm not a Crown guy. <laughs> Mickey Mouse, <Mel>, yeah. <laughs> Mickey ketchup. Hey. The starter. I have the escargot. It is uh, the snail with the bread. I also have uh, the duck confit. It is the braised duck. Do you see? Yeah. We're about the food. How do you uh, for enjoying the duck confit? Is it good? Delicious. Is it good? Well? Mm -hmm. eh? Good. It's delicious. And then with the with the uh, lettuce on the bottom. Yeah. It's like refreshing at the same time. My yeah. food. How's your food? Let's see. Tell me how it. How it is. It's thumbs up. All right, good. All right, what are you having? What are you having? Escargo. Escargo. All right. Let's see. Mayo. You wanted to try new things. Mayo, dip, dip, dip. Show us with your face what you really think about it. Okay. okay? We'll take All a right. Mm. Happy. Mm. What do we think? Okay. Uh huh. Flavor wise, mm. it's delicious. Yeah. It's so garlicky and buttery, and texturally speaking, yeah. I almost threw up in my mouth a little. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's the texture or just me knowing what it is, <laughs> but it almost it almost slithered back up. Uh oh. So I don't think uh -oh. I'll be finishing that. Uh, All right. I think that can All ask right. cargo. <laughs> The coffee. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Give it a time. I'm, I'm surprised that it came like this. I thought it was gonna come with like something. I but, think it's delicious, but let's see. I don't want. I don't want to bias you. Bro. You really can't go wrong with the coffee. Mm -hmm. It's like buttery, right? Tender, delicious. Duck cooked in its own fat. I think it's nice. Yeah. <laughs> you can't. It's hard to mess it up. Mm -hmm. Good. Get this. Yeah. Get this. I'm Georgia will say that's a thumbs up, right, Joe? Is that a thumbs up? Yeah. All right. What about what about you, Joe? How's your corn soup? Mm. <laughs> oh no! I'll be eating that. What do you got? Uh, it's a pear salad with cherry dressing. With cherry dressing. How is it? And mm. 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 Uh -huh. Good. 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 Mm -hmm. I got the potato and leek soup. That's what I got. Let's give it a try. It's good. It's very um, comforting. This stuff. Very comforting. Good. Good stuff. The uh, was it grilled tofu? Yeah, it's grilled. Is that couscous? Yep. <laughs> no. <laughs> give me a fry. Yeah, give you more vegetable. Mm -hmm. How is it? It's great. Oh. This is good. It's smoky. Smoky mm -hmm. from the grill, huh? Mm -hmm. How's the couscous? The couscous is good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got the Chateaubriand. With potatoes, demi glaze, and uh, <clears throat> Paracox Burks. It's pretty good. <clears throat> so let me just get this off my chest right now. That was the best steak I've had at sea. In the main dining room at Disney, better than the steakhouse at, uh, better than the 555 at Carnival. Great, Fahrenheit 555. Five, five. That place sucked. This was the best. Oh, it was so good. Definitely, definitely, if you're, a, if you're a carnivore meat eater, definitely get the Chateaubriand. Oh, uh, what'd you Ready? get, Joe? Yeah, I got apple pie and I got ice cream. Apple pie and ice cream. All right, go ahead and give it a try. See, let us know how it is. How does it taste? So that's your non Mario soup. That's for you. How are you enjoying? Is it good? So, the Grand Mania Souffle, Mr. Prince, and that's gonna be your feedback. Oh, 
So, thank you. Please enjoy. All right, dessert. Grandma ate souffle and cream and bliss. I think she, I think she could hit that grandma yay. Wow. She gonna be. Oh, not so. Yeah, she's gonna be ready to hit that Mickey dance party. <laughs> Good stuff. Wow. It looks delicious. And the bed is made. Somebody says she's sleeping there tonight, but I have a feeling you're gonna end up in bed with mom and pop. Here. I don't know, but. but we want to know, what the heck is this? What exactly is this supposed to be? Is it a bald eagle? Oh, it's a bald eagle! We're going to Alaska. We're going to Alaska. That is a bald eagle! Yeah, I yeah. see. If you squint and turn your head to the left, it's a bald <laughs> eagle! Wow. Look at the chocolates, too. We got some chocolates. Yeah, we got some chocolates. Sweet dreams chocolates, huh? Mm -hmm. Very nice. So, that, that means the chocolates here. Oh, that part the chocolate. Oh, that part the chocolate. Here we know the remark. Remark said the chocolate. Oh, okay. Chocolate's over there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. That sounds good. We'll get her lining them up. It's time to go to sleep now. Yeah. <laughs> Been a long day. Time to wrap her up. Take the ears off. Let the hair down. <laughs> and go to sleep. See you tomorrow. I'm here getting ready to go to sleep, but I just wanted to say one more thing <clears throat> that I've noticed about Disney Cruise Line that I very much, very much appreciate, and that is their dedication to, to cleanliness and just, like, keeping everybody from being sick, you know what I mean? Like, washing your hands before everything, passing out the, like, Purell wipe things before dinner, um, and at the, you know, everywhere you get food, it's really really makes me feel a lot more comfortable that my family's going to be uh, able to enjoy this. Nobody's going to get sick. So I really like that. And I'm just noticing here, this is the only, <laughs> the only cruise line I've ever been in where in the bathroom, they have instructions for washing your hands. So that's really cool. So yeah, um, so far I'm loving the Disney experience. I'm loving the cruise line, Disney cruise line, Thumbs up. So far, best food I've had at sea. Um, just walking onto the ship felt so, like, at home. Like, it felt, like, comfortable. It felt, like, soothing. I don't know what it was. I was telling my wife, it was like, it feels so comfortable here. Like, compared to other ships, it just feels so cozy. And I really have no idea how they pulled that off. But, like, some people say, you know, go to the parks, welcome home. Right? So that's how I feel. Here. I can't wait to explore more. We're going to go to sleep. Tomorrow is a sea day. So uh, we're going to see what else the ship has to offer. Live shows start tomorrow. Can't wait for those. Um, yeah. So stay tuned. More to come. I can't let you go, baby.